What good, everybody? How you doing? It, your boy Pierre Hollow and I. We're doing a another episode of the Hollow Podcast where we talk about everything gaming related, big and small, and we are doing it in multiple ways. So we're gonna have some good topic on the docket today. So we are going. Ah, uh, let's get into this one because oh my God, everything that been going down. Showed what I lo- love. Ooh, man, oh man, we are in for a good time. Also, on the t- my gaming anniversary, and I'm doing that on the podcast. Let's go. It's good. What's up, everybody? How we doing? So, let's go. Let's go. So, we are now talking for the new, on the topic of today, we are doing the new games that are coming out. Oh, mama mia, we got some good games coming out today. So, without further ado, let's jump right in. So. Everybody, what do you want to talk about? <laughs> Let's talk about it. Let's do the. So, first off, I've been kind of instead of watching it with my brother, I kind of watched it with my with some friends. They were three, someone was sleeping. Like, okay, why not? So yeah, we are got some pretty good. In- for those who, uh, hmm, I don't know where to start. Let's talk about it. You guys, you wanted me to talk about what I saw? Okay, let's go. So, let's talk about the games that are coming out. There's some, there's a couple of games. That been coming out don't and there is a lot oh my god there's a lot coming out so let's start off with the most most anticipated game that's coming out. Call of Duty Black Ops 6. I kind of got to log into it. I'm liking what I'm seeing. So. Well, you guys want me to talk to Bert on that. You know what? I will... I will go for all the zombie. Let's let's take care of you zombie fans. Who's a big zombie fan in the Call of Duty franchise? There is round bait zombie coming back in Black Ops Six. So if you guys are the big zombie fans, you're gonna get get your zombie thrill back. <laughs> So, I see Zombie Tree running around, and I'm liking. So, we have, like I said, Zombie Tree, Zombies are back. And let you guys know. Hold up, be what? Hold up. Give me a sec. All right. 
right? Okay, we got back on the... All right, we're back, we're back. So, sorry about the cutoff. We had a little bit of a te issue, so don't worry, we're back online. So we're good. Yo, Jerk, what's good? So, everyone, let's get back to the topic at hand. See, we do have round, round bait zombies coming back to the in the Black Ops thing, which is dope as heck, and I'm absolutely liking that because it shows like, hey, we're getting more, we're getting that throw of zombie back. It's like, oh, sweetly. I know a lot of zombies, but a lot of people who play zombies going to be happy with that one. So, that is definitely something I was going to be seeing. That's going to be blowing up really, really good fast. So, yeah, I definitely see that one might be coming back. So, next one is the multiplayer. So, that's right, multiplayer, there is multiplayer in this one, I, I saw it, and I actually seen a little bit of game footage, it's like, nice, very, very nice, so, apparently they're going to drop 16 new maps, it's like, what, 16 new maps? Holy crud. That's gonna be a lot of new map. It's gonna be a good amount of map to work and learn the layout of the land. Which is definitely something I would love to see happening. Oh my god, that would be sick. So. The definitely the, the the movement what I saw the movement mechanic is gonna be a little more sweeter and holy crap I caught a little, like I was watching the actual footage of the Call of Duty direct that's I was actually taking a look at what they do for mechanic movement mechanics. Like, holy crap. It's kind of like, I'm getting the feel, when it comes to the mechanic, I'm getting the feel of, they take a little bit of, hmm, Goat Recon, and mix it into the Call of Duty, which is definitely something I like. I definitely like it. Def that way we're not all... If you guys are familiar with the old Call of Duty mechanics, when you're prone, you're prone. You can't flip over, can't protect you. Watch your six. Any of that. But that's going to be a major plus on that matter. Because that is the most sweetest thing I I saw. It's like, like, dude. I definitely think the mechanic would be a lot more sweeter. For game, <laughs> some game, some <laughs> combat. Oh my god, I would love to see how that. I would love to get. I wish it, they're doing in the in the net in the Call of Duty net. Um, soon I would love to go, but unfortunately I can't. But that would be something I would wish I could be a part of. Yo, what's up? So, next thing. They got the new guns. I would definitely want to check out too. Definitely something very sweet. 
and I definitely want to see how this, how the guns feel in actual combat. In actual, actual play. It's like, dude, I would love to see that. Like, that would be really, really dope. And I can't, I'm sorry, I'm geeking out a little bit, so I try I doubt, like I said, there is, the mechanic of this like, is a lot more smoother, a lot more real light mechanics. It's like, dang. Also, for those who are liking the prestige system they in the the old Call of Duty, I got good news for you. They brought that back. So, if you reach the level, if you reach level 55, you can proceed to restart over with lost guns and all that. It's like, for me, it's like, I'm not a big, like, I'm not being mean, but I'm not a big fan of the, like, I'm a big fan of the Prestige system, but I do not like how to restart all over again. That is, that got me. That is so, grind my gear. But then again, we're talking about Call of Duty, but hey, it is what it is. So, what can I say? So. So next up. The campaign. That looked pretty sick. Yo. Yo, that looked pretty sick. I will tell you 100%. I have, so pretty much, the campaign, it's pretty much like taking, we're jumping in like to modern, but still kept in that, the 1990 vibe, because, that is definitely something I will love. Love that. Sure. Definitely something very, very intense. It's like, we're actually. There was actually so much we can, we can learn off of that. It's like, dang. That is sweet. And I can. And I want to see what, I definitely want to get my, get early asset. I definitely want to get early asset. Yo, thank you for the follow. Yo, thank you for the follow. Really appreciate you. Much love. I definitely want to see what the campaign got to offer. And I really wanted to see how that plays out. It definitely, I definitely want to see how that plays. Oh, oh, I'm glad you're following. I am, I am, I am so far. But, and I'm glad you're following. Much love. Now. We, in regards to the campaign, it's looking like I'm definitely seeing a lot of the old 90s stuff. And like, that would be dope to see what's going on. But, overall, I'm definitely going to be getting the new Call of Duty Black Ops 6 game. And, run, and I'm going to be running that. So, next up. Uh, on the game docket for me at least is Perfect Dark. If anyone ever played Dark the the Dark series on the N sixty four, you will know what exactly what on that game is about. It's like it's like dude, that is sick. It's like the perfect dark game. It's like wow. It should I'm amazed how 
fluent that game got. Like, I played the, the old game on the N64. It was good. But a lot of the, but dang, they changed that, they cranked that up, made it better, like, Jesus, that is sick. I don't, it definitely has, give me that vibe of the single player, but I don't know if they got that multiplayer set up yet. That is something I may have to look into further down the road to see how well that's going to develop. Man, oh man. I would definitely love to see how amazingly set up that is. And I gotta say, that looked pretty dope. No, no joke. No joke. We got, there's the other game that popped up too. Too, and some of you guys may not be like into the games I'm interested in and I can understand that. But they have it, they have it, they got it up. And so you can go through it, watch it. And see what games that you like that pique your interest. And I will not, and I will, I'm not stopping you guys to see what you guys like. It's like, go ahead, check it out. <laughs> but for me, I would definitely want, I definitely would recommend if you want to look for a new game that's coming out soon, definitely check that. Now for the next one, and this is, for me, it's the most beautiful, this is definitely so beautiful. Clean. They brought Assassin Creed Sha Shadow. Um, if I said it wrong, I apologize because. But they brought Assassin, a new Assassin Creed game that's been revealed. It played at the Ninja and the Samurai. It was like, ooh, that is sweet. Like I get to pick between. Sh Samurai and Ninja, or I get to play at both. If if I play it at both, even sweeter. It's like God. Uh, it definitely when I got the when I watched it, uh, when I watched it, it definitely is like in the feudal in the the feudal Japan era, which is a I gotta say that was pretty dope. Like, we're actually getting two history merged into one. And I might remember incorrectly, it's like the Daimyo era. era. I don't know for sure. I may have to get back to you on that one, guys. So, bear with me. So, I definitely think that might be a very good... I may have, I haven't brought up my Assassin's Creed skills in a while, so I'm going to have to get that run through. And I'm definitely going to have to go to see what they're all about. Definitely. Oh my god, there's so many good games. And hold on, I haven't forgotten. Those are the top three games I'm looking forward to. But, but I know some of people like Diablo, so I got you, I got you. So there is another, I believe there's another chapter. Another chapter of Diablo. That's why I'm about to double check. It now, okay, and now that I'm looking into it, it's actually a DLC. It 
It looks like a DLC. Yeah, it looks like DLC pack for Diablo 4. Diablo 4. So if you guys are interested in Diablo, no matter what console, you can be playing on PC, Xbox, the PS5. The the release date of the DLC is eight October 8th. And I saw it was crazy. It's like mind blown. If you guys ever wa you watch the, the, sh the open trailer, it you guys see how mind blown that is. Like, wait, don't even. There is a lot of new game that coming out, and I'm definitely saying they're gonna be. I would definitely say. 100% this is going to be a very good selection I'm definitely looking forward to see what they got for upcoming releases and a couple of them are coming up next year some of them close to the end of the this year like I would definitely say that's going to be a more interesting year for gaming it's like <laughs> get your <laughs> all I gotta say is get ready to for, for those who are playing like playing to get games get ready to grind them the late night oil for this one ladies and gentlemen because This is going to be a very, very good year for gaming. <laughs> I definitely see this is going to be a very sweet game pick. It's still it's coming year and that year. So, what can I say? Mmm. <laughs> All I can say is, dock up, get ready to grind, because that is going to be the sweetest, that's going to be the sweetest, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just excited for the upcoming games. There also flight simulators. Microsoft got a new flight simulator game coming out, coming out, which is pretty dope. And holy crap, games are gonna get sweeter. I go by. and I have to say. I don't know about you guys, but the games are looking pretty sweet right about now. Don't know what they're gonna. I know Blizzard got something coming out too, but I may have to do another sit down and watch it. For those who are actually saw the actual. So you guys know exactly what we're looking into. And I gotta say, I'm liking what I'm seeing. But alright guys, that would be it for this episode of the Hollow Podcast. I hope you enjoy this episode. I enjoy the, the upcoming games that are coming out. Which, me on the hunt, there will be more, I think there are more games coming out. Don't know if there are gonna be more, more, but all I gotta say is, stock up, game, and game on. All right, guys, I will catch you guys on the next episode, which will be the twenty third of this month. So, guys. Okay. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.